You heard about my girlfriend, Jayla Brizo. Jayla Brown. I love Jayla Brown. I don't know how to, talk. I don't know how to explain this or what I want to say. But what I want to just do is express my love for Jayla and tell y'all and tell the world how I feel about Jayla. Because Jayla, she's not a regular person. She's very special. She's like an angel out of heaven. She is like, to me, more than human, more than a person. I'm addicted. I'm fiending for her. At all times, I be fiending. I be thinking. I be like, what the fuck? And when Jayla ain't around, I be like, what is Jayla doing? Who is Jayla talking to? Hmm. I wonder. No one knows. Though I know all things. I know all things. Who gonna tell me what I tell you? And what they tell them? And they gonna keep it real or they gonna be fake? I don't know. But let me speak how I really feel. Let me not be all like a hoe. Let me act like a bitch. <laughs> Oh, I'm so in love with Jayla. I am in love with Jayla, though. I don't care. That shit crazy. I tell you, it's crazy the way a female can make a man feel like that shit can, you know, that shit can break, take you, make you, and break the fuck out you. A female can take you, make you, and break the fuck out you. Because they know how to get to your emotion. That shit crazy. They know how to get to that internal, that deep, that thing inside of you. Where it's like, they know how to reach that part inside of you where it's like, Damn. It's the I don't know how to describe it. They know how to reach your the emotion. It's like this world is a hard, cold, hard place right now. And so as a real man, you're a real gang not gangster, just a real man. And y'all need that soft, you need that female touch to come lighten up my brain up my day. You know what I'm saying? But not just any female uh, this is only specific about jail, I don't know. Cause like Jello, she uh she's a trouble child. <laughs> Let me not say that though. The thing about Jayla also though, she's eighteen. I'm twenty eight. So that's ten year different. That's why I'm gonna name this video too. Alright, I'm gonna make another video called should a 28 year old date an 18 year old? Is that a good idea? I think it is, cause uh, even though it ain't a good idea, I can't leave Jayla. I never could leave Jayla. Even if I act like I was leaving, I was faking. Every time I tell you that we're done, I'm faking. I want to bring you to your knees, begging for me, begging for me, push to the ecstasy, how far are you willing to reach? I'm slamming the door, but I'm staying, I make up my mind and I change it, it's you that I want when we're breaking, every time I tell you that we're done, I was faking, I'm losing the game that I'm playing. Oh, and now I think about it though. Cause let me be real and honest with the shit. Kinda Jayla though. It's, I ain't gonna speak bad on her name. I ain't gonna speak bad on Jayla. But she did got flaws. Like, fuck. Now when I say flaws, I mean, like, that bitch got a lot of flaws. I don't trust that bitch. Yeah, I do. She ain't no bitch though, but I don't trust her like that. I don't trust her too much walking. I can see that bitch, and I can't see that bitch too much. I just kept it though. Because I had to come to the point and realization that whatever Jayla do, I'm probably ain't never going to leave her because it's too painful to leave Jayla. Me trying to leave Jayla, that's a lot of pain. Like, that's a daily pain. Like, that shit makes me want to. And I had sat back and I thought, you remember that dude, Huey? Who did that? Who did do the comedy? He killed himself over that bitch. Committed suicide over that hoe. 
And when I first seen that, I was like, what kind of weak ass, soft ass nigga is this? Commit suicide about over a hoe, over a female. Then I, now I get it. Then now I get it. That shit can hit. That shit can fuck with you. Because this is the thing. That shit get deep. Because this shit, they'll they feed. These females, they'll feed this to you. They'll feed this shit to you. They'll feed this thought, this, this, that to you. And how you thinking this, this, and that. But really, it ain't this, this, and that. It's that. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not this shit crazy what females are doing. I don't, I don't know, I don't try not to, I know, I done made it to shit before, it made me strong, it made me never fall into no shit like that again, cause, I was fucked, I was down bad, I was almost died that day, I don't want to make it through that day, I swear to God I was about to die, I ain't know how the fuck I was breathing, and I thought Jay looked at me, like, I was like, I was gonna fly, you know what I'm saying, they had long distance, show me to stay in Georgia, I'm thinking about, going to Maryland to visit her. It's just, from the outside looking in, from my perspective looking out, it's like, okay, I love her, so I'm about to, I go see her. But from the inside, outside looking in, it's like, you a lot older than her. She just turned 18, she's still in high school. Why you want to visit her like that? Even though you're not old, you're still in your 20s, I get that, but still. It just be coming. But I want to go see her. I might go see her. Uh, I want to go see her. I could go see her whenever I want to. It's just, why would I go see you? And we can't even go a week without all of y'all. So, we need to have a time where we can just get along and then we can be like, okay, it's time for us to meet up now. Because we, we go, we, like, we argue with this. You just played me for the last time. I beat dump in my drawers. They go like, oops. I know they get beat down for hours. For hours. I'm going to the club tonight, but I ain't going for. I don't find no female because I ain't looking for no female because I already got a girl, Jalen. Mm -hmm. So I don't look for no female until I the club. Mm -hmm. Now, don't mm -hmm. get a twist. I know I'm the shit. I know I'm that shit. And a lot of females are trying to talk to me all the time. I don't think that shit's fine because it ain't got nothing to do with Jalen. This just got to do with me as a person that I don't like people. And so that's great. But I've been trying to change my ways now. That's why I won't go out now because I know I've been doing better. I mean, God done healed me from all my badness that I'm going through. So now, it's time for me. Cause I'm going to the club now, baby. You know what I'm saying? Say what it is. I'm not going to be loyal to Jay Lee for nothing. So I'm going to get that. I'm going to get my Not that anybody gonna be in my car. I don't be fucking anybody in my car. How about I ever fuck anybody in my car? We gonna speak on that. I'm just a nasty shit in the car. I ain't lie. No worries, lie. Yeah. I done had white bitches and black bitches up in the backseat. I done had white bitches and black bitches up in that back seat. I was busy. No, I wasn't. That's a song that I heard. Anyway. How much it is? $12.99? $12.99 for some joggers? Big please. You can't even wear joggers in the club, bitch. Fuck so cool. I'm throwing it all black. Pop up in that bitch with them diamonds in me. Diamonds on me. Should have bought some white jeans. I done got some white jeans. Pop in that bit with them diamonds in my teeth. Last three, I was my phone one day. I sit back on my phone.
Mm-hmm. I'm fine, baby. This is about all you like. This is all for the video. Let me make another video. I'm tired of that shit. Part two, second part. Jada Brown, where the fuck? You heard, man? That's how they gonna go. I had to make this out of this shit.